Thank you for calling. Please press 8 7 to speak with live executive. Thank you for calling Microsoft Support. How can I help you? I, I, oh, I thought I was calling Norton. I, I, got, I got a bill from Norton. For, no, sir. For a what? Uh -huh. No. You are not calling Norton. You are calling Microsoft Technical Support. How can I help you? I, I got a, a bill for uh, Windows Computer for Users. I, I don't know what it is, but this is the number that, that was mm -hmm. on the bill. I don't know. Your Windows? Mm -hmm. what, do you, I, I don't know what's going on. Yes, we are Windows. Okay. So you don't have nothing to do with this. Okay. What does... Hello? What does it say? What does the message say? It says customer ID, invoice number, order number, personal PC, charges four eighty eight ninety nine for Windows users, mm -hmm. twelve month subscription. But I don't know why. But if it's not you, I don't. Okay. So. Okay. Uh, so what you can do right here is you can give a call to Norton, okay? Okay. I think Norton are the one who provides you internet, right? Your Wi-Fi. No. Norton, no. I got Spectrum. Then why you were receiving a message from Norton? So, uh, it says problem, Norton for uh, product Norton Lifeline. If you want me, I'm sorry? The product it says is Norton Lifelock, but this is the number they told me to call. Mm -hmm. Okay, I completely understand your point, but sir, um, what I want you to understand at the same time is this is not Norton. This is a Microsoft technical support. If you were facing a problem on a computer, on a network, we are the one who will be giving you the service. Uh. So you're not the ones that sent me this bill. Why they give me your number? I wonder. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. I really don't have any idea. I don't have any idea either. Okay. Well, I don't know what to do. How to take care of this bill that I don't want to pay. Uh, I don't know. I have to search. Okay. So, uh, if you hold on, hold on. Okay. If you are using Spectrum and if you are receiving a Norton bill. There's a very high possibility that your computer or your personal information might be compromised. Uh, you might be affected with a, with the hacking problem or a virus. So you want me to check it for you? Yeah, maybe uh, you think that might be it because I don't even know what this bill's for. Yeah, you know, can you look into it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, sir. So. In order to do that, first I will be requesting you to help me with your first name. My Just first, your first name. Ari. A R I E. Okay, and also here, um, what I have to do is first you have to connect with Windows uh, Secure Server to make sure you have a secure connection so that it will check it exactly what is going on, and as I said, according to the Okay. Okay. So now, what I want you to do, I want you to have a look at your computer keyboard, what? your typing keyboard. Okay. Your, your typing keyboard. My keyboard. I, I'm. You're breaking up. I don't know what's wrong with your phone. Yeah. Okay. I got my keyboard. Okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Mhm. Mm okay. Okay. So. At the at the very at the very bottom, bottom. on your left side, did uh, you see control like control yeah. key? See, yeah. Okay, so next to the control key, what key did you see? The flag key. Looks like Windows. Next flag. to the control key, what key do you have? The flag key, the Windows flag thing. Okay, so I want you to hold it down, the Windows key. Okay. And press it together with letter R as a Romeo. With R. a T and R, press it together at the okay. same time. Okay. This 
thing came up. Type name of program. That's great. Okay. So it's the box. It's the, there will be an open, and there will be a box, a bar where yeah. you can type on it. Yeah. So is it empty? Yeah. Mhm. Okay. So on this open box, I want you to type over there. H. Let me split out for you. H. Okay. Elton Harry. H. So make sure whatever you are typing there, there is no space in it. Okay. No, there's no so, space. Please read it back to me to make sure you are typing it correctly. HTTPS colon slash slash MKRA dot CC slash 8443 slash. Oh, give me a moment. Uh, okay. After US, what do you type? After what? Oh, I'm sorry. After Charlie Charlie, what do you type? Slash eight four four three slash. No, not slash, sir. Not slash. It should be colon. Colon. Remove the slash and put it. Which colon. one? Which which slash? After up. Uh, huh? Okay, let me repeat it back for you. All right. Oh. Okay. Are you ready? I I got everything up to okay. CC. After CC, uh, what comes after CC? Okay. After CC, it is colon. Okay, you didn't say that. Okay, colon. Okay, colon. I'm sorry, yeah. Then 8443. 8443 slash. Okay, I got that. I got all that now. Slash. Yeah, I got slash. it. I got it. So please hit on OK. Okay. Now, when you hit on OK, what do you see on your screen? Secure connection. Join with a code. Okay. What's the code? Yeah. So let me provide you the code. Okay. Yeah, your secure code will be 502. 502. 69. 69. Okay. 50269. Yes, there will, there will be a... Oh, what? Uh? Yes. There yes. will be a blue arrow. A blue click arrow. On that. Yeah, I clicked on that. Okay. Join session. It says. Okay, and. Uh, what? Yeah. Now look at your right side. It says, do you want to run this right application? Do you want to run this at application? The top. Yes. Do I run? Yes. Click on yes. Screen client mm -hmm. connecting. Okay. Okay. So it's joining your session. You have successfully connected. Now, look at. Look okay, up. so there will be an X sign. Close X. that. Click yeah. on that. Click on the X. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what do you have? Same thing I had before. It says secure connection and my number. Okay, close that. Close that. Okay, now I got nothing. Mm -hmm. Now, what I want to do, yeah, so what we are going to do right here, if your connection, it is completely secure right now. Okay. As you are connected with Microsoft Secure Server. Oh, okay. So we are going to check it while you are receiving a fraudulent bill. Okay. So first, let's go ahead and check your network, okay? Okay, all right. So, once again, Windows, along with R, please. Windows key and R key press it together. R, okay. So you will have the HTTP. You rest that. Okay. Now, type it over there. A command C as in Charlie. C. M as in Mary. M. D as in dog. D. Yes, and hit on OK. Okay. Windows. So now you will be having a black screen. Yeah. Okay. Microsoft Corporation. Right. See? Yeah. Okay. So on that user, I want you to type it over there. N as in Nancy. N. So the whole word which you are typing there, it is net. Set. Net means your internet. Set means the status. Okay. So hit on your enter key. So wait for it. Once the scan stop running, please let me know. We we will be seeing all the IP which you are connected currently, which okay. you are 
connected at this very moment. Okay, All right? Okay. So uh, is it still scanning or has the scan stopped uh, it's running? It's done. It's done. It's scanned. Uh, uh -huh. uh, now, what do you see on your screen? Establish, 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 time, wait, time, wait, time, establish, establish, time, wait, establish. Okay, so what I want you to do, I want you to look at the very top. Did you see active connection? Yeah, yeah, I see them. Yeah, local, Okay. state, Just form. Just below that, did you see, yeah, local address. Okay. So below the local address, the address which you are seeing right there, that is your IP address which is provided to you by your internet provider. Okay. So when I'm saying IP, do you know what is IP? IP, yeah, it's that local address. No. No. IP stands for Internet Protocol. Oh, Just internet. like your home address, this is the address of the internet which you are connected. Okay. 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 So below the local address, how many address did you see? Ah, uh, there's a whole bunch of them. One, two, three, four, five, there's like ten, twelve. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay, that's completely fine. And the first and the second letter is it all the same? Yeah. One. You mean you mean one nine two okay. one six eight? And next to that. Uh -huh. Yes, okay, yes. These okay. These two should be the same. Okay, they're the same. Is it the same? They're all the same, yeah. That's right. Okay, great. good. Okay, sir. Okay. And next to that, did you see foreign address? Yeah. So that foreign address, this should be empty. Empty? No, so there's, a, empty? there's no, there, there's numbers and letters and stuff in there. Oh, my gosh. Uh -oh. So let me know. How many numbers and how many letters did you see? Oh, and there's a whole, there's a whole bunch of them. Yeah. And on the page, what does it say? Does it say establish or timely? It says uh, uh, both. Some establish, some are time wait. Both. Mm -hmm. So how many of the foreign address? They have established into your network. Please count it. How many established do you Six, see? seven, seven, seven established. Mm -hmm. And below, uh, does it give you any reports? What does it say at the very end? It says, uh, oh, address, IP address is hacked. I didn't see that. IP address is hacked. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. So, sir, um, what? Mm -hmm. It said to let you know that the IP address, this has to be in private, but unfortunately yours, it has gone public. And as you can see right there, there are seven devices from foreign location which has established in the network. Where are they? I wonder. Where are so they? So in short. In short. Okay. They are located in foreign address. Foreign. Okay. Foreign location. That makes states, sense. Yeah. Not from United States. Not here. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, that might be the reason why we're getting a fraudulent transaction uh, receipt from Norton when you are not using a Norton uh, Wi-Fi. Not so using Norton Wi-Fi. Okay. What is the activity or what? What is what? Mm -hmm. So which means for? Huh? So which means whatever the activity which you are doing on a computer or which you are, which is connected to your current Wi-Fi with your current network, it is not secure at all. Because uh, those hackers, they hackers. have already hacked into your network. Oh no, so, well, I got a vest. Mm -hmm. When a vest but stop them? A vest is an antivirus. Oh. No. And no. this is an anti-virus protection. Oh, okay. Right now, we are not talking about virus. We're talking about hack. Oh, I don't understand this so, stuff. Okay. My question to you will be. Okay. Oh, okay. Don't worry. I am here. Okay, good. So, my question to you is how many devices are connected with the same Wi-Fi? I don't know. One, two, four. 
So the cell, the number which you are calling me right now, is this your cell phone or this is your landline? Cell phone. Okay. And your Wi-Fi is connected with the Wi-Fi. And what about the other two devices? What are they? Um, I got a fire stick in my oven mm -hmm. and the washing machine and my printer. I got more than that. I got more, I guess. Yeah. Okay, they are all... Mm -hmm. Yeah. But sir, a printer or washing machine, they cannot be affected with any hacking or any virus. Well, Don't worry good. about that, okay? Okay. Any smart device. Yeah, any, any smart devices apart from your computer and your cell phone, which is connected with the same Wi-Fi. Oh, okay. So the, my washing machine's all right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So, so now, uh, now what we are going to do, yes, we have seen that your IP, it has been hacked. So let's go ahead and verify it, whether your IP it is in private or it's in public. Okay. All right? Okay. So I want you to close the black screen. Okay. Mm hmm Okay. And which browser did you use, like Google Chrome or yeah, Internet Chrome. Explorer? Chrome. Okay, open your Chrome. Okay. And on your Chrome, I want you to type it over there. What is my IP address? All right. Let's check In it. My IP address. Right there. Yes. Okay. So the first option, I want you to click on that. So uh, now, what I want you to do, check it here is, did you see, did you see any red flag given to you? Any what? Any what? Red flag. Red flag? It says hide my IP mm -hmm. now. What does it say? Uh-huh. It says. At, at the top, what does it say? Does it say your location is secure? No, it says hide my IP. I, I don't know what it means. So, which means the IP address which you are using right now, this has gone public. You have been hacked. That's the reason why it is requesting you to hide your IP address and remove the hacker. Okay, how do I hide it? So Just here, click on this. We are already 100%. You cannot hide it. Sir, you cannot hide it. Oh, how come it says hide it? We have to hide it from the server. Oh, okay. So, here, as we can see, uh, we are 100% sure that your IP, it has been hacked yeah. and it has been exposed. exposed. If you look above that, it will say your location may be exposed. Yeah. You have been exposed, so now... I want you to close the. I want you to close your Google Chrome. Okay. I'll close this one. Okay. All yeah. Right. So what we are going to do is, as your computer, it is connected with the same Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and check it whether your computer is also being hacked or not. Okay. So once again, bring up the run box. Windows along with R. Windows R. Uh-huh. Okay. What do you have on the box? CMD. Remove that. Okay. And type it over there. E as the network. R is the Romeo. Uh, oh, wait a minute. So software is updating. Please wait. I can't even type it in there. Okay, All right. No, wait no. for it, sir. Uh, your R. software, I think you haven't updated. Okay. Event BWR. All right. So, yes, hit on OK. Now, what do you have on your screen? So the event viewer. Mm-hmm. OK, uh, below that, did you see custom views? Yeah. OK, push on custom views. So even if your computer is hacked or if your computer is being used by those hackers, those hackers. you will see there is an error and warning, okay? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So, click on, no, uh -huh, click on administrative events. And let me know if you receive any error and warning. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of error, warning, 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 error, warning, 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 and boy, there are a whole bunch of them. I don't know. 
Oh, wow, I can't. Mm -hmm. I can't believe there's so many. What are they? Warning. Uh -huh. So did you see the dead in the time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So at the top, may I know how many number of events did you see? 6,628. Oh, okay, sir. Uh, as you can see right here, the the server, it has been constantly giving you an error and a warning regarding about the hacking which is happening, but unfortunately, you might not be aware of it. And if well, you how would I move, see it? I wouldn't even know how to get to a, it. I don't know. Uh, Why did they make it like this? Sir, they are hackers. They are hacking your network for their own benefit. Oh, like I'm bastards. Understand it. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. All right. I just don't know how they all got in there, and I didn't know about it. How come they don't put this where you can see it? Mm -hmm. Sir, I completely understand your concern, but let me tell you, those hackers, if they hack into your network, which means easily they will be hacking into any of your devices which you are connected with the same Wi-Fi. So that, that thing, uh, it has that happened thing. to you uh -huh. right now. So not only your network, they are hacking into your computer as well. Oh boy. So, which means whatever the information which you have on a computer, they will be misusing for their own benefits. So uh, we never know. Never know. So let's not waste time. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and run a final scan. Yeah, let's So do that, that we will be able to find it. But, uh, yeah. Okay. So that according to the problem, I will be able to uh, fix it right okay. away. Okay, okay, yeah, okay, let's fix this. Okay. Uh -huh. All right, All right. So close your even viewer, please. Close this, okay. <sighs> yes. Okay. And now, once again, I want you to bring up your run box. I can. It says our software is updating. Please wait. Why does it keep on doing that? Mm -hmm. Sorry, it will, yeah, it will keep on happening. I'm sorry? No, I just don't know why it keeps on updating. Because, sir, your network, it has been hacked. Uh -huh. You are not the only one who is using this network. They are other people from seven different foreign locations who have used it. So, while you were connected, while you were connected with the secure server, which is the Microsoft, to make sure those hackers, they are not interrupting, every time the software will be updated in between to oh, make sure that nobody is interrupting. That makes sense. While we are scanning. Okay, I understand. Okay? I understand. It yeah, it happens from the server automatically. Automatic, okay. All right. Yeah, so okay, now, now, once again, bring up the run box, windows along with R. R, okay. Now. Oh, uh, what do you have there? You might, you might have an even viewer. It's which a, you yeah, before, it's still right? there, yeah. Okay. Okay, so I want you to close that. Oh, uh, sorry, I want you to uh, clear that. Okay. You, <laughs> uh, type in uh -huh. the same command, C as in Charlie. C. M as in Mary. M. D as in David. D. Now, hit on OK. All right. And now, once again, yeah, I want you to type it for the final scan, D as in David. D. I as in Indiana. I. R as in Romeo. R. Forward slash, S as in Sugar. S. Yeah, hit on your enter key. And now. You will see it is not only scanning your computer, it is scanning your whole device. Well, that's a lot of scanning. Your network, your... Uh, uh. Yes, sir. So once you can stop running, we will be getting a final report from the server. Okay. So please wait for it, okay? All right. Software is mm -hmm. updating again. Oh, must be the hacker tried to get in again. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. So security breaches computer is hacked, IP address is hacked. www.pornhubpoker.com Found bank account on poker. Security is not recognized uh -oh, as an 
internal external command operable programmer batch file what's so that mean? I want you to read it all to me I just did read it all to me from the very beginning please oh. mm -hmm. security breach this if computer... you don't mind could you please read it back to me I'm trying security breach this computer is hacked IP address Thank hacked www.pornhub.com poker.com amazon Dot com was open on this computer today. All private personal information is compromised. Fraudulent transaction found from bank account on poker.com on this computer. Security is not recognized as an internal mm -hmm. or external command, operable program, or batch file. I don't know what that means. Mm -hmm. okay. All right, so, sir, uh, as we can see before, Yes, we are aware that the computer which you are using, as well as your IP address, which is your network connection, yeah. it has been hacked by a hackers from foreign locations, seven, right? Seven locations, yes. So, uh, as you have... Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So, as you have been hacked, here it is saying that you are watching pornography, you I'm not watching poker, pornography. As well as you were playing. Mm -hmm. I'm not watching pornography. Did you watch pornography in no, any of your I don't watch pornography. Mm -hmm. And what about poker, sir? Poker in the front? No. Uh, did you play poker? No, I poked her. And, uh, okay, so do you uh, do online shopping from Amazon? Yeah, that I do, yes. Because I buy yarn on mm -hmm. Amazon, and then I so, sell pot holders on Etsy. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what that's from. Uh huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. I completely understand your point, sir. Uh, you might not be the one who is watching porn. No. Or you might not be the one who is playing poker. I poker, no. But understand it. Your personal, yeah. Understand okay. it, your personal information is compromised by the hackers. Okay. So they might be the one who is what creating your account and uh, visiting a corner site. Oh. They, and also, they might be the one who is like well, well, I gotta get rid of this. What if my wife, so what if my wife Sally Susie's pornography on here? I can't have that. She'll get mad. How do we yes, get rid of it? We got to get rid so of it. I will help you to fix it. But yeah, she that, don't like me doing that. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, I'm on. holding. I'm holding. But I'm upset because mm -hmm. Sally Sue, she was nuts if she sees pornography. Uh -huh. I understand. But, sir, what we have to do right here is uh, my main concern. Yeah. Your computer and your IP, I will be helping you to fix it. Okay. But my main concern is your private and your personal information is compromised. Okay. As well as there is a fraudulent transaction found from bank account on www.poker.com. Uh -uh. So, okay. I would like to know, uh, you have already mentioned to me you did not play poker. No. But may I know, do you understand what poker is? I poker, yeah. Yeah, poker yeah. is an online fake gambling. Yeah. In order to play this game, you have to enter your financial information. So, which means those hackers, they have, they have your personal information, which is your banking, and they have already created an account on poker as well as a porn site. Oh and no! They also there is a fraudulent transaction coming from poker. So. What we are going to do right here is we need to go ahead and uh, drop a mail to the fraud department and okay. to the headquarter of your bank. So okay. uh, first, what I would like to do is I want you to log into your Amazon account and check it if there is any uh, any order placed under Am your name. Amazon is on my phone. That's on my phone. That's not here. I don't have it on here. Am I do Amazon with the app. I don't do it on here. Okay, then check it now. Mm -hmm. Check the what? Okay, then check it on your... Uh, what about your email? My email? Yeah, do you have email on no, your computer? it's all on my phone. 
But sir, I will not be uh, authorizing you to use your phone Why? Because those hackers, they are hacking into your network. Your cell phone is not connected with the secure server, so I am not going to take any No, no, we don't want to take any the chances. The server which is connected, it is only your computer. Okay. So, what I want you to do is I want you to close the black screen and open your online banking and check it if there is any fraudulent transaction coming from poker or as you were saying that there is a charge coming from Northern, check if there is any fraudulent transaction, okay? If there is, please let me know. Till then, I'm working on your file. Oh, software is updating again. I can't see my bank account. Okay, sir, wait for it, okay? Oh, yes, boy. Yes, wait for it, wait for it. Okay. Wait, and once you got your screen back, please let me know. Well, how long is it going to take to update here? Sir, uh, it might take a few minutes because understand it, this is not done by you. This is not done by me. This is from the server. Ah, okay. So we have to wait for it, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. My mouse is moving all over the place. So... All by itself. Yes, sir. We in technical work. Technical work. Okay. In technical work, we call that calibration. Oh, we that's oh calibration. Okay. It is the calibration. It's calibrating my mouse. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it makes sense. Okay. <laughs> so earlier you were telling me something about your wife. So. Uh, Sally Sue. Can you explain that to me, please? What do you mean? Explain what? I'm sorry. What do you want me to explain? No, earlier you were you were tell, you were saying that your wife uh, might knew that there is a porno site. So You're where right. is your wife right now? My wa my wife went shopping out to Walmart. Oh, okay. So we gotta get this done before she gets back. Okay, so do not okay, worry let's hurry. about it. Okay, let's okay? hurry. Let's care. hurry. So your wife, she doesn't want you. Uh, she don't like you watching porn? No, she gets mad. Because I look at the sexy grannies. Mm. Well, I mean, if I did. So even when you are watching uh, sexy nannies, your wife, she's angry? Yeah, she doesn't like me watching that stuff. She's a church lady. She goes to church all the time. <laughs> I don't go to church. Oh, okay. She's a church oh, lady. All right. She's charged. Yeah, she's holy I roller. She's one of them holy rollers. Okay, I got my bank back. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Okay. So check it if there is any fraudulent transaction coming from Poker or Norton. If there is, please let me know. Well, there is. There's one from Poker for two thousand dollars. Okay. Can you give me the death in the time? Uh. It says pending. Oh, okay. All right. I got you. So, sir, now, what I want you to do, I want you to sign it out of your account as soon as possible. Sign it out. Okay. So, you do not log into your, uh, uh, to this account again, okay? Okay, I'm out. Until and unless everything is safe. Okay, I'm ready. So, yeah, so I would like to know how many accounts do you have? Just one. One, two, or three? Just one. Bank of America. Okay. All right, so what I want you to do right here is do not touch your computer. Okay, I okay? Won't. okay. Leave it as it is because okay. I will be taking care of it. Okay. Now, now, what I want you to do right here is I will be drafting a mail to the headquarter of your bank. Okay. And may I know what is the name of the bank where ba there is a fraudulent transaction? Bank of America. Okay. So I will be dropping a mail to the headquarter of your Bank of America okay. because this fraud thing or this hacking thing, it this cannot be taken thing. care by your local bank. No. Yes, it is a pending transaction. Okay. So once I drop a mail to the headquarter of your bank and to, to the fraudulent team, yeah. they will be taking care of each and every. Oh, okay, good. Okay? Thank you. Okay. So now... Now we're done? Mm -hmm. Are we done now? So do not touch your...
Yes, sir. No, we are oh, not done. Not done yet. How long we is this going to take? Done. Sally Sue's going to be home pretty soon. Sir, be patient, okay? I'm trying, but I don't want to no. get in trouble. No, what I want you to do is... She'll bring the preacher over here to I talk know. to me. I don't no, want to go through that computer, again. Don't worry. I don't want to do that again with the preacher, man. Yes, sir, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, if regarding your computer, I will be taking care of it, so your wife, she will not be able to see it. So we have to get, uh, we have to make sure that your personal information is secure to make sure you are not facing this kind okay. of problem okay. in the future. Let's go, so let's go, let's go, I need hurry to move up. your information in order for me to drop your mail, okay. your first and your last name, please. Uh, Ari, A-R-I-E. Huh? And your last name? Posse, P-O-S-S-A-Y. What is your last name? Posse, P-O-S-S-A-Y, Ari Posse. Okay, and your date of birth? 31650. 31650. 5-0, right? Right. Okay, and also the address which you are residing at this moment? This moment, I'm at 100 Main Street, Moravia, New York, 13118. Okay. 13118. Right. Okay. Okay. So you are in New York, right? New York, yeah. Uh huh. Uh, what is your zip code? 13118. Didn't you write it down? Uh, so, which state? New York. We just said New York. 100. Uh, street, uh, 100 South Main, Main street, street, North New York. Yeah, 13118. Sir, uh, the zip code is not 13, uh, okay. Uh, so you are in Moravia, right? Moravia, yeah. But we got the same zip code with Groton, because we're two little small things together. Uh -huh. So they stuck us together with the same zip code. I, I don't know why. I'm not in charge of that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, so once again, I will be requesting you, please do not touch your computer. Okay. My level five technician, they will be working from the background. And background. Let me, uh, let me first complete this file so that okay. I can go ahead and drop email. Okay. Please do not touch your computer okay. and stay connected. Okay? okay, let's go. And by any Hurry. chance, if the light connected do not panic i will be giving you a call back okay i i, I won't panic hurry up though or else uh, hurry please hurry yes i'm trying my best the scam is taking so way too long paper. okay what i'm sorry i didn't hear what you said what is taking too long the scam what is taking too long the scam lady the scam you rundy the scam the scam you're trying to pull on me, stupid. What do you think? You dumb fuck. No, you are the one who is dumb. Come on, Rundy. You are Rundy. wasting your whole time. I, you I'm, wasting I'm wasting your, your time. time, stupid. Just I'm wasting off. your you time. Wasting. No, you are... You I'm, are not... I'm wasting you your time. My time. You can't you scam. You time. can't scam somebody else if you're fucking around with me, can you? Stupid. Scam gonna take. You might. How long is this scam gonna take, you, Randy? <laughs> oh, you tell you tell your buddy what I said. Huh? All men, remember. What? All men, remember your account as well as your computer is being hacked. Be careful. Okay? No, it's Next not. Time, not. It is not do being not hacked. Challenge. It's not being hacked, you fucking idiot. Hello? Hello. Can you hear me? Yes. Hello? Hello, can you hear me, stupid? Hello? What do you want? Say you something. Say? What do you want? You fucking idiot. Yeah. What? What do you want? <laughs> The text now subscriber you are trying to reach is not available. Please leave your message after the tone. Hello, you stupid fuck. You scamming bastard.